Hello some viewers how are you all welcome back to another video guys in this video we are going to discuss how to remove duplicates and while removing duplicates we'll discuss the various methods how we can remove the duplicates so without any further ado let us start the video So as you can see in the screen guys, we have already created a file remove duplicate various methods .js. Now I will create a simple array. So I will write let a equal to 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 6, 7, 8, 9. So I have added duplicates but I don't know exactly. By the look of it I can see 2 I have added extra duplicate. 6, 7, I have added twice, etc. So, imagine you are in an interview. So, interviewer will give you this question and he will ask you to remove the duplicates of this array by different scenarios. How you can remove the duplicates. So, I will write the first way here. So, we can have many, many ways. So, I will just write the first way. Try using includes. So, now. In order to do the first way, you have to already declare a simple array, null array basically. Let's say b equal to null. Right? What is the what is the first thing which strikes your mind? So definitely a loop. So now let us take a loop. So I'll write let i equal to zero. So i less than a dot let i less plus. So now guys, so what happens here whenever the loop runs, it will allocate the value okay, i is equal to 0. This is a post increment. So now i becomes 1, then length is calculated. So you can see here length is always calculated, but i value is changing. How why can't we make length value outside? Why can't we calculate outside so that it will not impact the performance much. So I'll write let length equal to a dot length. So now I'll give length value here. So now what is the first thing we'll write? If if condition right if not equal to b dot includes of a of what does this mean so now so b is null right so b doesn't have e of 1 that is true b doesn't have whatever they of i has now what we'll do b dot push so this will push as long as u there is not a unique as long as there is a unique value this loop will iterate with, with the if condition. If there are not unique values, this will not execute. So now, let us see console.log of b. I have to push a dot r. Now, let me execute it. Now, as you can see here, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. See? What are the values are there? What are the not unique values they have been removed? So let me uh, let me comment each and everything. So I'll not comment B. So I need B. So I'll comment the so I'll comment the first way. Now let's go to a second way. Here what we'll do? We'll have a temporary variable. Let's say temper. And here. What we will do, we will do it in a simple way. What if the interviewer asks, okay, sort, first sort the array, then you remove the duplicates. So I can do a dot sort is a method which will sort the array from ascending to descending. I think it's already sorted, so not an issue. So if you want, you can add, let's say, you can add uh, 7 in between or 9 
right now for now this will work say dot sort will make this seven uh, nine go to the back and one two three four five what are the lower numbers will come on the beginning so now let's use for loop like how we have used in the beginning so let's take phi equal to zero i less than the same length i'll use i will not use a dot length then i'll use i plus plus now here i'll write if now here i'll write if a of phi not equal to equal to temper if it doesn't match what i'll do i'll do b dot push of a of i and i'll do what the same value i'll do temper equal to a of i so i'm assigning temp variable the value a of i so now let me have console dot log of a of no not a of i console dot log of b array so let me execute it so as you can see here we have one two three four five six seven eight nine sorted and also we have removed the duplicates so now so let me comment this also let us see the third way i want to comment this console log also so anyway i'll remove the comments and i'll put the code in the description so that will be helpful for you guys to play around with the code and let me know if you find more duplicates ways let me know in the comments below fine let us see now the third way so third way is an object so i can create an object let's say x object which is a null object so i can write that x equal to an object right so of course you will know the key value pairs in an object keys are always unique so now i'll use for of loop so i'll write let i of a for of loop is there i'll write x of i equal to i'll write uh, 20 something like that let us see what actually now uh, what is available in x so x is an object we know right so what i am giving here x of i is equal to 20 for each and every value of an a of a key i am assigning a value so each and every key has a value so let us see let us now print the x which is, which was an empty object before so now you see here so let me expand this terminal here you can see so one two three four five six seven eight nine see it, it it has become a unique these are unique keys keys can never be duplicated indirectly it is giving us unique values but now you may ask okay how can i extract this Okay, 20 I have added as value, that's fine. How can I extract this? Now, to, in order to extract this, we have a beautiful method here. So let me comment this console log. So let me uh, write console dot log of object dot keys of x. We just need keys. Let us see the answer now. So we got a proper array, which is unique and also duplicates have been removed. So third way is by creating an empty object.
so let me comment this also now so in order to comment guys you have to add control slash you will directly comment so fourth way is a little tricky way but we'll see what it is you guys would have known what is set sets have been introduced in javascript so let us take an example so let's say let simple set equal to we should we should write a new constructor we'll write set so as you can see set of what is our array it's a so now if i write if a console dot log simple set so what will i get set can never take a duplicate so set will only have the unique values by default see you have one two seven nine three four it is not sorted by the way but they are unique see we have one two here 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 here, 8 here and 9 here. So now, now what was what was happening is so we are getting set and also we are getting the length here. So size is 9. Now what you will ask, okay. So I don't want this. This uh, video is all about removing duplicate from an array. So how can I retrieve an array from this? Okay. I have a solution for that too. Let us see like this. So, what you have to do? You have to write a array symbol. Right? Open bracket, close bracket. What we usually give for an array. So now, give here triple dot. So it will indicate the spread operator. So now, just write simple set which you got. So let us see the answer. So let me comment this also. Let me execute it again. So you'll know the difference here. Now you got an array. It doesn't have duplicate values. All are unique. And also this is the fourth way. The fourth way I'll write is using set. Hope you have liked the video guys. I know there will be different ways for retrieving the unique values from an array. So let me know in the comments below what are the different ways so that it will be helpful for others who are attending the interview if they come to see this video. So that's all for the video guys. If you like the video, please click on like. If you're a new viewer, please click on subscribe. Till then guys, take care. Have a great day. Bye-bye.